Hey guys, what's up? It's Mig from Max Beats here with the BeatStars tutorial on some of the techniques that I use to close the deal. All right, so I have a few different ways that I do this, including the way I build my funnel, the way I use my pro page and my website, the way I use my YouTube channel and my Facebook. All right, so we're gonna dig into this and hopefully some of this will help you guys uh, get some more sales. So. That's it, let's do it. So check it out. So I have my pro page open here and if you don't have your pro page set up already, you should go into your dashboard on beatstars.com, go into your account, go into your dashboard and set up your pro, pro page because the pro page is really, really cool. I mean, it's, it's a self-contained website. Now, I know you heard me say earlier that I have a website as well, I do. I have a website with my, uh, my players installed and I also have my pro page. And what happens is I linked two very similar URLs to each one. So I have a maxbeats.com and I have a maxbeats.net, which is my pro page. And I like to use them on a track uh, different ways. But one of the ways that I'm, I've been closing, closing deals and sales is by actually using some functions in the pro page, including this little gem right here. So... Sometimes a customer will hit me up and say, hey, I'm interested in a beat, I can't find it. I'm interested in a beat, but I don't know which option to check off. So this past week, I posted one of my sales and you guys were very interested in learning how was I able to close a sale like that. Well, uh, I had actually clients hit me up on my messenger on Facebook and one of them wanted to know why there was no exclusive option. So I went and checked and realized I hadn't uploaded my stems. So I said, give me 10 minutes. I'm going to upload the stems. They were like, we're very interested. And um, so I made a beat exclusive and they wanted some other tracks too. And I basically went when I was done, I actually typed them back and said, I'm going to make this really easy for you. If you want to do this transaction now. And they were like, yes. I'm like, okay, cool. So what I did was I went and I added, I went to my pro page. I went and typed in maxbeats.net, which is my pro page URL. Yours might be somethingbeats.beatstars.com if you didn't change your URL. So I went to my own pro page and I basically went and I added the beats that they were asking for to my cart. And then I went up to my cart and I said, proceed to checkout, like right here. And what I did was proceeded to check out oh, no. there, oh, there we go okay cool and then I went right here to this button that says share cart and I got my cart link and I went over to the conversation in my messenger over here and I simply dropped the uh, cart link into messenger I said you're all set the stems are there your wave files are there your mp3s are there all you have to do is hit the button to make a purchase and 10 minutes later the purchase came through and you know there are times when i get people who are like they say they're interested and then when they realize you know sometimes what the prices are or they might get cold feet they may not go to your site and actually go through the process they chicken out uh and then they abandon cart in this case this person was ready to purchase so I literally gave them no other reason to abandon. They knew they wanted it now. So I dropped the link into Facebook Messenger and they paid. So that's like a really big thing. And I've used this more than once where I actually take the cart and I share the cart. And you could post that link. The cart link, even on your YouTube vids, you could basically say like, put a, put a beat in the, in the cart for the video that you're making and put that cart link in your video description and uh, you should be able to then just direct them right to checkout right at that point. So that's really cool. Now, another big thing is like, well, how did I get to this point of actually getting the client and everything else? So here's my website. It's called, it's maxbeats.com. And then down here, you can see, hi, how can I help you? Or how can we help you? And then they have to click on that to send me a message, which I get a lot of inquiries. Once they click on this continue as, it then takes them to, being part of my Facebook Messenger, okay? So now I have them in my Messenger queue, and once I have them there, I can do all kinds of stuff. 
I could send a, a campaign targeted to these people. I mean, it's, you know, there's so much you can do, but I ended up installing something called, called chat fuel. And the way chat fuel works is it gives you a landing page like this. So when they go and they end up in your messenger queue on Facebook, uh, by going from your website first, or even from your pro page, if you integrate with uh, something like Data Crushers, then once they're in your queue, you have them there to send out broadcasts. So when I upload new beats or a new tutorial, what I do is I go right here to my chat fuel in dashboard and I go, I want to do um, broadcast. And a broadcast will bring me to this page right here. And I'll basically create a broadcast, which is like any kind of information I want to share with those Facebook Messenger subscribers now. So whether I do a new tutorial on how to record a vocal to, you know, to a beat or, you know, a little bit of information on how music publishing works, whatever it is, I'm able to then send that out and keep them interested in what I do. And then in the midst of that, when they click, they also get this link right here. And what it does is it allows me to add like, Here's my newest beats. Here's my newest swag. Here's my drum kits. And then, you know, it just says, hey, how are you? Welcome to Max Beats Live Chat. If you have any questions, please let us know or visit some of the popular, link, popular links below. So that's kind of like the sequence that I use. So they go from my YouTube videos with my beats and then they might click on um, this button up here where I've installed my chat fuel live chat button. So that's right here. They click on that. It takes them to the sequence or within the description of some of my beats, well, actually all of them now, I have all that important information, including how they can chat with me. And that's like right here. So new beat, instant download, subscribe, click the bell, our website, question, live chat. So I get a lot of people into my live chat that way. And I respond to them every time they send me a message, but eventually those messages and customer service is what's gonna lead you to the point where you're like, hey, let me be your personal shopper and you know, send you, you know, send you the tracks that you're interested in. All you have to do is hit the PayPal button or the credit card button. So that's really it. If you guys find this stuff useful, definitely please follow me as I, I create more tutorials uh, for you guys this year through BeatStars. And also my YouTube channel is youtube.com forward slash Max Beats, M-A-X-X-B-E-A-T-S. There's my logo. Um, and that is really it. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, please feel free to hit me up. And uh, don't be a stranger. I wish you guys lots of success. Peace out.